As the sun rises, a beady-eyed Stefan approaches a merchant to buy his house. Hello, I am Mr. Steve Steve, or some might call me Stefan, or Mr. Steve Steve. And you are watching my Oblivion playthrough. Um, right, in previous episodes, I'm um, just going to jump straight into it. I have been trying desperately to get 5,000 gold to buy a house. Now, no guesses where I'm going to buy this magical house. Um, the house is actually Anvil. Um, if you don't know what Anvil's house looks like now, uh, I will go and show you. But yes, uh, I have been tirelessly doing this. I am, um, in fact, killed Phelan for the Dark Brotherhood. And I've been doing how I play the game, so as such as like exploring dungeons and general whatnot and hoodie hardy and bedlam so right this is the ramshackled house of anvil um Benerous manor i wish it changed to your name such as like i would like steve steve house or the steve steve manor um or stefan's residence would be quite nice um but it's not it's Benerous manor and on a lighter note um yeah that's that this is the house right Let's go. Let's go procure this house from a fine young gentleman. Who wouldn't dare in his right mind try to slander me, try to, you know, schneid me off with a horrible house, a cursed house, shall we say? He would never do that. I would never imagine so. Who could curse a house and sell it to another innocent man, a stranger? It's beyond my wildest dreams. Who would do such a thing? <laughs> right, so you're at Benerus, Velling, you're you. We're all wondering uh, when more of those evil gates oh. are going to open. Well, in fact, you are going yes, to leave the town because technically, house. when Benarus I buy your man. house, I'm, uh, you're, you're going to leave town. And I hate to Excellent. say it, you're going to leave me in the shit. If the no one's played the game, ship. that's what happens. I hope you now, if Where you off to? Where you off to? I did get quite a deal on the house. It's actually a manor, not a house, so you know, you should research the fact if you're going to sell the house. Right, I'm actually going to turn the volume up because I can't really hear. Yeah, other than that, no. I've done nothing um, apart from break my headset. Now, they're quite expensive headsets, and when I stood up, I uh, got trapped under my chair or beanbag, and the wire is pulled out, so I'm technically playing with my hands. Like fumbled around this wire and pushing the wire in so I can hear and not hear through the TV so it's a little bit awkward but here here we are new new residence I'm not a vagrant anymore I'm not a gypsy or um traveling man what was that what did that say because I skipped through it I've arrived at my new house in Anvil Burris Manor looks like a place me needs some work but it's a great deal and I could just pass up couldn't pass up I can now make myself at home. Right, well, this place is just a shit hole. Whoever lit these candles is very, um, fortunate. Uh, that vase is going to stay there for a long time. Ooh, nice vintages. Very nice, very nice. Uh, very, very nice. Bargain, no table. Broken chandelier, but you know. You know, that's about it. Uh, let's put some lights on, because um, I don't think I'll be able to see very well, nor do you. Um, and also equip a pole. Oh, beautiful, beautiful. Oh, I like the sh van... That. A basement. No, nothing ever goes wrong in a basement. Preposterous to say that. <sighs> wow. Nice veranda. Lovely chest. Lovely desk. Um, I've had enough of this. One more, one more. You ready? You ready? Lovely veranda. Verandas are beautiful. Right, let's let's go to sleep. Let's sleepy. Let's sleepy. Cause I'm a tired person. Just bought a house. Exhilarating. Oh, what is this? Oh. Oh. Who goes to sleep with a torch on and then zombies come and ghosts? That's wrong. It's not nice. Scare a man to death like that? Is that what you were achieving? Wanting to achieve Mr. Benerous Ghost, sir? Well, you didn't. But I'm half scared to death. 
Oh! Oh! I'm getting a bit cold in here. Real life and and game life. Oh! Ooh! Exhilarating! I never knew that was gonna happen. Wow! <sighs> oh, that was just a ghost dying. Bit ectoplasm dropping. Oh! Oh, what's that? What's this? What's this in this? What's this in the distance? I wonder what it is. Is that a is that a hand? Yeah. Who keeps a hand out there? Yeah. Found a skeletal hand next to a page from a diary. Ooh, the people are handful of worms. This doesn't sound very good. Must only come out in the rain. Alright, oh, wow. I must protect myself from these meddlers. They shall not interfere in my designs. What designs is this, Mr. Benner, sir? Ooh. Scratch my head and call me Jimmy. I don't know why you'd scratch my head and call me Jimmy, but... I don't know. Only then will they know my true power and know how... Whoa! Some serious shit. I bet's not. You a ghost. You're a ghost, okay. There's two ghosts. You two ghosts? Yeah, you two ghosts. Leave you to it. There, I'm going, I'm going, don't need to chase us out. Wow. Imagine being chased out your own home. Imagine buying a house for 5,000 gold for one, but you would think it was a bargain. And then being chased out by a bunch of horrible, torch, weird ghosts. It's it's not natural. Ugh. Don't want that. Skeletal hand. Ugh. High five that, you'd probably just die or something, I don't know. If you high five death, the, you know, the enigma, oh, the essence of death, then you will die. Um, I'm, I'm guessing that would have the same effect. Wow! Right, where do I go? Oh, I'm gonna go and ask around town. Where's he gone? I can Where's Veloin? I'm not sure oh, where okay, I'll ask at the Count's Arms. Alright then. Let's go Count's Arms. Go to Count's Arms. Right, I'm just gonna have a swig of water while I wait. One thing this game never has is water, so you know, you're just constantly drinking alcohol. Um, in some respects that's good, in some respects it's bad. You will have a bad liver, but you'll probably be a lot more confident every day. And confidence is the key, that's how you get jobs. And having good grades. So stick in. As soon as you bought the place, I know he did. He went to the Imperial City, that's that, so. Eee, it's nasty. Yes. Ooh, and you're nasty. God, everyone's nasty in this town. I should have probably just went to Imperial City and bought that house. The hovel on the seafront. No matter. No matter. Sorry for me being a role-playing no noob. I just... Um, I knew what's gonna happen. I've I got I actually got afraid the first time that happened. Um, with the whole ghosties, ghosts are nasty. They try to sneak up on you when you're asleep and feel your privates. So don't let ghosts feel your privates. Or else you'll um, you'll have to go to the police station and say a ghost felt your privates up. And I would imagine that's probably not the best thing to say. Cause for one, you would. Uh, da -da. Let's let's just leave it on that. Right, where is this? Oh, there you are. Well, uh, yes, you chased me out, my man. Yeah. So you think I'm responsible? <laughs> I suppose you're right. Is the man? Oh, oh, so you sold me a cursed place. Nice. Not that I predicted this in the future, in the past. I suppose I should have warned you, but I had to get out of Anvil. My family said I could move here to the Imperial City once all our loose ends were tied down. So, you basically palmed me off a horribly cursed house. Nice. Very nice. It did get the better of you. Your greed did. I suppose I assumed you'd be able to lift the curse and be done with it. I know he's a strange man. He kept a skeletal hand in a bloody vase. Who's straight? What's, 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 um, you know, saying about that? mostly harmless. Until the fateful day he came across a tome. Bearing the evil of <gasps> necromancy. He became necromancy and decided that by using necromancy, he could prolong oh, that's his nice. own 
the dark arts contained in the tome called for him to dig up the recently deceased. When it was discovered that he did this, mm -hmm. the mages gave mm -hmm. him a quick meeting to decide what to do. Talisa, I don't know what you're saying. Decide. Led by a young right, upstart then. named Carahill, the mages guild stormed mm -hmm. Benarus Manor and slew Lorgren. His body vanished. How peculiar. Vanished. Maybe that was the curse. You should have investigated. Of course, you weren't alive at the time. According to the diary entry, oh, it seems that I, wow, the only there's a secret door in the manor, in the, the basement. Oh, slightly guilty selling you the place under these yeah, circumstances. Yeah, you should. From there, okay then. Let's. I'll You'll see, see me back at Anvil, dude. Now I'll see you back at Anvil. I hope you make it, and not get mugged on the way. Cause that would be really bad. I've just bought a house for five thousand gold, and um, it's cursed. Thanks, mate. Thanks, friend. Thanks, friend. I can really see our, our relationship progressing to the next level of best friends or almost acquaintances. That's what you are. You're an almost acquaintance, Mister Benarus. Uh, uh, very angry. And if it wasn't nearly 12 o'clock at night, I would be getting myself a cup of tea to calm my nerves down. But I can't. What a nice to end. What a night to lift a curse. Full moon, or whatever it is. Um, starry night. Perfect. If only it was raining. Uh, make it even better. But I don't think it is. It's not. I can see for myself it's not. Nope, no one here. Okay, let's wait. Oh, well, it's one o'clock in the morning. He'll be asleep. He's got to rest. He's tired, this little Benner's head. I think he will be awake now. Not awake? Oh, oh, okay. Oh, are Ready you awake? Well? Yes, you are awake. Hello, Mr. Benner's uh, half. half. Oh. Yes, I'm ready. Then let's get this over. Are you yeah, a request character, so I don't actually need to keep you alive for this. Pardon me. How unprofessional of me. Must not burp on camera or voice recording thing. How very in inappropriate. <laughs> no do that. In the space of me doing this commentary. I've probably drank two litres of water, I just want to point that out. Very healthy of me. Especially when all I drink is tea. Very bad. Ah, <sighs> oh well, this is not bad. Nice dawn as the sun rises. Mr. Benarus, sir, and Mr. Steve Steve, go to lift a curse. <laughs> ah. One in... Hot leather lingerie, and the other in a burgundy suit. Which on a previous save I enchanted to make myself, myself, totally invisible. Yes, that suit Mr. Benarus is wearing, sir. Sorry for that, I just kind of, uh, got a bit carried away. <clears throat> Awkward. You've got an awful smile on your face. Grinning. Mr. Benarus, sir. If you look to your left, there's a naked mermaid. Oh, well, her boobies or her assets are covered by her hair. Yes, her hair. Hmm. For a man of luxury and, um,. Definite uh, high class standings living in the Imperial District and all. You surely wear shit shoes. I just want to point that out. Your shoes are definitely awful. I mean, fair enough, mine are, but mine's a onesie. Mine's a one suit. Can't really change my suit. Alright then, you're in there, I'm in there. We're getting ready to fight some z z zombies. Well, ghosts, but the same thing, really. I've arrived in Benner's Mail. I must proceed cautiously to the secret room's entrance and prevent any harm from befalling us. Okay. Okay. Sorry I had me bow out when you were talking. Oh! You're right there, Mr. Zombie, sir. Stop throwing. Oh! Hello! 
How's it going? I'll just take one for the team. Shall I, Benners? Mr. Benners, sir? Uh, ow, that hurt me. But only a little bit. I'm still fine. I'm fine. So are you. You've took no damage, you cheeky bugger. I would like to see you take some damage. It is my fetish. Oh! Oh! Is that two? I think it's two. I think it's two. Oh, there's three. You like the third one? You're... Brett. Um, you're running away. You're Jermaine. And... I think the other one just died. And he's merry. And they were quotes from Flight of the Concords. Or characters, sorry. Oh! God, you are magic, man. It also appears I haven't turned into a vampire, which is also good news. I would hate to be a vampire. Um, unless I was one of them vampires where I could stay out in the, in the, in the light. That would be so cool. Like, you could run really fast, but through the light and stuff. Open that baby up. Open that puppy up. Very nice touching doorway. Is it going to open yet? Or am I just going to have to steal here? It's not really a pole, is it? It's more of just a hole in the wall. Lift the curse. Mana rumours. Yeah, just, just bloody do it. Nice one. Go on. I'll stand guard. If you can call it that, really. I'm just kind of floating here, waiting. Oh, there we are. Oh, don't run away. You're part of the bloody mystery, aren't you? I'm pleased we were able to get that secret door open. Oh, nice. You just kind of run away, you stupid chihuahua. I'm a husky. Or a wolf dog. Let's seal this puppy up. Oh, no, I can't. Oh, no bother. Tome of Unlife. Ooh, sounds very, very um, prolonged lifey. You all right there, Mr. M? Oh, you're speaking, and you sound just like your um, nephew. Mr. Um, Mr. Benarus, sir. What are you doing? Mr. Logan, sir. What are you saying? You found repentance. That doesn't really make sense. I have to say so myself, Mr. Benarus, sir. Missing a hand, I see, Mr. Benarus, sir. You sound like the Dread Father. You sound like Mr. Benarus, sir. Mr. Benarus, sir. You, you sound like all of the Imperials. I hope you realize that. For that, you will get a shot in the eye. And the crotch. Ah. I would like these robes. Well, I can't really finish the quest until I kill you, so... Actually, I'll need these arrows, especially for the fight that's coming up. Street Fighter Battle. Battle. I'm going to battle. Bye-bye, Mr. Benarus, sir. What are you saying? You're just groaning on. Like, I tend to do in a commentary. It's just ridiculous. Get done with it, because I've got to try and finish this up by 20 minutes. Oh. A bit of a horsey voice. I've got a bit of water left. Oh, oh! Don't spawn, Mr. Headless Zombie says. It's not very nice. And you, you're a tough son of a bitch, aren't you? And I need a paralysis spell. Oh! I'll just. Oh! I'm being attacked here. Oh! No, this isn't good. It's alright. It's alright. It's alright. I've got. I've come prepared. I think. Um, I hope I've come prepared. Yes! High five, imaginary viewers. Well, not imaginary because you're kind of viewing this now, but people that I would be talking to if, um, don't shoot frost at me. That's my speciality. Oh, you reflected the packet. Doesn't matter. Don't matter. You've run out of uh, stuff on your bow as uh, staff. Well. And you, get away. I would get a headshot, but you're missing a head. Oh, oh, I'm sorry. Did that hurt Mr. Logan, sir? Did that hurt Mr. Benner, sir? Well, I better shoot off you, bitch. 
Let me use my health portions. Who do you think you are, Mr. Big Star? Now, what does this do? Nothing. It's just got a weird aura around it. Hmm. That was one tough cookie, wasn't it, people? What was this? Oh. Oh, don't need a pelvis, but I will have that. I'll have all of these. And what's in there? I'll have that gold, because I'm greedy. Well, I'm not really greedy, but you know. You know, if it's lying there. Eh? I mean, of course I wouldn't take money off a dead person. That would be kind of weird. Um, if it was in the will. I tell you what, this is getting kind of creepy, so I'm just going to leave it. It's not really a portal. It's just a door that moves. It's kind of cool, though. I want one of them. I want one of them. Why doesn't B and Q sell one? <sighs> B and Q, get on top of it. Or any good Home Depot service place. Because, come on. And what, imagine one of them in your room. Or away in your house. Oh, I can't open this. I'm trying to I'm trying to lockpick it. Yeah. I'm the, I'm the magic man. So I'll be like, of course, it'd be kind of awkward if you um, had a girlfriend who was had to try to get in your house, and um, you'd have to be there with her. Because I tend to just let people in. Of course, not strangers, but people I know. They just say, just come in. Then. So, yeah. Unless I can give them, like, a key, like a magic key where they could open it with, like, a scroll. But I, I don't think people use scrolls nowadays, being 2011 and all. I think people use like books, which is, you know, the ten ten to happen. Oh no pads, no pads. Oxford no pads. Very good. Really high quality paper. Really good for drawing as well if you can um be bothered to draw. Right, where are you? Hello, Mr. Benner, sir. I'm sorry. Are you really? That, He's run away from us and I had to kill him. You know, he probably wouldn't have killed you, considering your um, his Neither nephew in some sense. Respect. I'm now off to oh, a hey, grandson. Once more. Enjoy them. It I suits me well. I know it bloody well suits me, because I bloody killed the owner. <laughs> <laughs> Go on, run away with the tail between your legs, you mutt, Chihuahua. So, I will always remember you as a Chihuahua, the type of dog that runs away. Strokes chin and writes us down in a notepad. Chihuahua. Mr. Chihuahua, sir. Sound like a butler when I say that, but you know, hey ho. That's what I say. That's what I do. That's how I do it. And um, by the way, if he knows you 100% and likes you very much, he will let you off with the bounties. Mr. Lang, Stay sir. If you want. Sounds deception. That's nice. I thought I already did this. I've just harvested morning glory! Which can be misconstrued into two things. Ooh! Look at this! Uh, it's a horrible vase with deathly hand in it, but we'll go with it. Oh, how sexual is this? You know what? You know what? This will always, always be here. Um, this. We shall never move. Um, nah, it's not, it's not very, um... Memento, is it? It's not very mementos, is it? We need something with mementos, like. Um. 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 I know what, exactly what it is. We should put there. This. Because we will never forget the fateful day when I beat Mr. Benner, sir. And uh, reclaimed this house on my own. A bit like what the English did in India. Or in so many in other countries. Thank you. This has been a pleasure. This house will suit me well. But it's... Come on. Come on. They better not stay there. Fair enough, it's a good source of ectoplasm. But, you know, I don't want dead ghosts in my house. Um, One bug you will find with this house. And I'm just going to state this one before I end the video. Is... This bed, um, is like a magnet for vampires. Um, I've slept in that bed three times on three occasions. Um, well, many occasions I've slept in this bed, and I've had to reload because I've turned into a zombie for some reason. Not a zombie, a vampire. But they're the same thing. They're just undead. So you know, 
you've got to be careful with this bed. I mean, there's no other bed in the house, so you could just rent in house like a bed down the down the um, pub, but that would be defeating the object, wouldn't it? I mean, let's see if it doesn't now. See if it doesn't now. Oh no, it's all right. It's all right. So it hasn't done it on this safe, but you know, it's something you've got to be careful of, because I don't want to wake up and some. I don't know, my next door neighbour's biting me neck and going, You alright, that's Stefan? <laughs> and going, Mmm. Yeah, it's alright, uh, what are you doing? I'm just turning into a vampire. Oh. Um, I didn't want to be one. Uh, we kind of an awkward situation, if you know what I mean. So yeah, that would that's my ideology behind the whole situation. Anyway, thank you very much for watching. Um, please subscribe, uh, it does mean a lot. Um, Considering I do put a lot of effort in the videos, even though it doesn't seem it, it I've got a table back. Oh wow! Um, I do put a lot of effort in the videos, and so does Chris when he does videos, um, and we do them together. So if you could subscribe, it would be really nice, and it's free and whatnot. Uh, please like and that shabuzi, shamazi, shamazi. Uh, thank you for watching, and I will see you later. Thank you. Good night.